हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू मेक एन एक्सपेरिमेंट ऑफ व्हाट यू कॉल इट एज पेपर क्रोमेटोग्राफी हेर यू कैन सी वी हैव मेड अ सेट ऑफ फॉर एक्सपेरिमेंट ऑफ क्रोमेटोग्राफी यू सी हियर वी हैव टेकन ए फिल्टर पेपर एंड यू कैन सी हियर देर आर टू कलर्स ऑफ इंक वन इज ब्लू and the other one is red and here in this bowl we have taken water you can see how the chroma chromatography works the question is what is chromatography in a paper chromatography experiment a small amount of a sample solution is placed on a strip of chromatography paper or filter paper the chromatography paper is then suspended in a solvent as the solvent moves up the paper the individual components of the sample solution separate out in bands of individual color that means here you can see that there are two colors one is blue and the other one is red if we put water here the as the water moves up the two colors will separated in two positions you see first of all we give some water such that the filter paper absorbs water along with the color you see here there are two colors one is blue and the other one is red and you can see that how you can separate the blue color and red color in this paper chromatography you see here we are adding water to this bowl you can see that this paper is absorbing water from this bowl and you can see how it moves up the paper as it moves up the paper the color of blue color and red color will separate and this is known as chromatography you see here you can see that how the color will be differentiated into blue and red color again we are giving some more water so that it may absorb more water and as the color moves up the color will separate out as blue and red here we have added water and it will take some time so that the blue color and red color will separate out and you see how the red color and blue color is separating from each other and you can separate the blue color and red color in this chromatography experiment see here we have added some water we'll add some more water you can see it will take some time but the colors two colors will separate out due to chromatography experiment you see here one red color is there and another one is blue color is there and you can see that the two colors will be separate out from one another and you can use it use this experiment to separate blue color and red color and this is what we call it as paper chromatography it will take some time but you can see that how the color is separated from one another one blue color will be separated from that of the red color when you see how it is how the water is coming up the paper and you can see that the red color and blue color will separate out with one another and this is what we call it as paper chromatography you can add more water so that it may take less time let us add more water with it and let's see what happens
this is known as paper chromatography dear friends you can see that the red color is here and the blue color is here that means you can separate the colors of blue color and red color in this method and the method of this experiment is known as paper chromatography you see here how the color is going up as the color is going up you can see that the two colors separated here you see the below is the red color and the upper one is the blue color in this way we can separate the two colors of ink in this paper chromatography it will take some time but you can see that how it it is separating the two colors one is raw red and the other color is blue and this is what we call it as paper chromatography it is an inexpensive method of separating dissolved chemical substances by their different migration rates across the sheets of paper that is it is depending on the migration rates from one point to that of other and you can see very clearly that we here you get the red color and here you can get the blue color and in this way we can separate the blue color and red color in a very efficient way and this is this experiment is known as paper chromatography and here we have taken filter paper or you can use also chromative graphy paper but here for here here used the filter paper and it is acting as the same as the chromatography paper right you see here how the color is differentiating between the two one is red color and the blue here you see this is the red color patch and you see this is the blue color patch in this way we can separate the blue color and red ink separately in the method of paper chromatography this is what we call it as paper chromatography in paper chromatography water molecules present in the pores of the filter paper act as a stationary phase and the moving phase can be a solvent like hexane toluene acetone or a mixture of solvents such as methanol water mixture etc in this way we can separate the blue color and red color by the method of paper chromatography dear friends in this way this is what we call it as paper chromatography you see here we can separate the two colors one is red you can see this here this is a red patch of color and this is the blue patch of color we have separate the two colors in this method and the method of this is known as paper chromatography dear friends if you like this video please subscribe like and share thank you everybody for watching this video